Hello, Wolf Pops. <laughs> it is your host, Rathias. And we're, today we're going to be playing Five Nights in Anime, the novel. I know, I still haven't finished Five Nights in Anime 2. Uh, still working on second night or third night for you guys. So, uh, I haven't really pushed that aside. Just haven't got through it yet. <laughs> so, in the meantime, I figured Five Nights in Anime, the novel, would go better in the meantime. Um, that way you guys aren't thinking, oh, oh, like we're not going to get any content on that. So, let's get into this. A note. Do I need to click on this? Yep. This game contains copyrighted music. If you're playing it on YouTube, you might have to edit it out. Sorry. Oh, great. Thanks for the heads up, I guess. Uh... Hold on, I think I can... Hmm... Okay, we're just gonna go with that sound on that. Also, most things sexuals are unintentionally so put there for lack of a better picture or just for less. Oh, we already know that. Night 1, 12 a.m. Well, I didn't hear anything so far. It's just a phone. Or I guess there it goes now. Oh, I'll edit it out later. Bursu! Hey, hey, hey! Congratulations on your new night work job! I actually worked at this place before you. Crazy, huh? I just moved to days. In fact... Anyways, I'm recording this message to help you get settled in on your first night. I know it can be quite overwhelming there, but you'll be fine. Although the girls do tend to get a bit weird during the nighttime, nothing to worry about. I'm trying to channel my inner Marusu. I, I do follow him. <laughs> uh, I'm probably not there, but I will try. The animatronics. The animatronics can get into a little bit of mischief at night, so be aware that the girls do tend to explore the place. They are put in some sort of night mode, so they're limbered up for their shows in the daytime. Or something like that. But anyways, the only real risk you would have, if any, is the fact that the girls here, uh, if they see you, they tend to play a bit rough. Now that might sound good for some people. <laughs> But with the heavy outfits they have, you can imagine the discomfort. It can be tough when you're first starting off, but hey, the first night should be a breeze. Talk to you tomorrow. Remember, check your cameras and check those doors every now and then. But only close them if you absolutely need to. Alright, goodbye. You. Alright, typical FNAF clone. This should be a piece of cake. Just let me see what I'm up against. As you go to check for your camera, you hear a noise coming from the halls. Kill them all. Uh, check the left door. <laughs> oh, Bonnie. Hi, Pumpkin. Are you the new security guard? Oh, crap. Get away from me. You reach the closed door, but she stops you. Wait. The person on the phone has it all wrong. We just want to talk to you, you and be your friend. And maybe engage in the sexy times later. <laughs> uh, alright. Don't kill me with your boobs, please. <laughs> Not yet, anyway. So... Where are the others? I know the other ones are here. I played the original Five Nights. Uh, I don't know what you mean. If I can show you the rest of them, follow me. Yeah, probably. Yeah, I don't really care for that song. Hold on. Sorry, no offense, but... Not only do I not want to not edit that part out, but I just don't care for the song anyway. So, Bonnie. Oh, uh, I don't know what you mean, but I can show you the rest of them. Follow me. This is Chica. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> and this is Freddy. Hey. What's up, Freddy? I'm showing the new night guard around. And boy, was he scared at first. I'm glad he's the one who wanted to actually trust us. What, nobody else has ever listened to you before? Nope, they're all rather think that the guy on the phone is right. And I don't really blame them. She said they were scared of us without getting to know us. Of course they should be blamed. They were only scared of us because the phone guy told them to be. It's not like 
They just avoided us because he didn't like us. Anyways, I'm going to show him Foxy, Mangle, and the back room. Don't you think it's a little unnecessary to show him the back room? Even though the ones in there don't have an endoskeleton, they still freak me out. Maybe Chica's right. Steer him clear of the back room for now. Oh, alright, let's go. Foxy, where are you? Silence. Foxy, I know you're in there. I was scared of this. Foxy's a bit shy. I guess I'll just have to go get her myself. Oh, no. I'll be back in a minute. Don't go anywhere. Mm, Foxy, get out there. You have someone who came to see you. Mm, but I don't want to. Oh, come on. He's a nice guy. Honest. Fine, but only if you wait in here. Uh, hello? Hello there, are we playing some peekaboo? Hey, <laughs> hey, you're funny. Uh, thanks. Mind if I ask you a few questions? Uh, sure. Question one, why do you take this job? Because I'm a huge fan of the restaurant. This isn't quite was it, what I was expecting, but I still like it here so far nonetheless. Hmm. Oops. Oh. How do I get out of this? Oops. My bad. My bad. Question two. Who's your favorite animatronic? Oh, I really couldn't answer that. Out of all you have met so far, you're all wonderful. Ah. Question three. What are your intentions with us now that you know what we are? Basically, we just hang out and be friends. I mean, I wouldn't mind talking, taking it further with any of you, but I need to get to know you and wait until you thought it was okay. Hmm. Okay, I hope you keep this job. You're the first thing other than Bonnie, Chica, Freddy, and Mango I've ever trusted. Can I come out now? Yeah, sure, you guys can leave now. Alright. See, she's not so bad once you get past her shyness. Yeah, she definitely seems to like me. Where are we going now, by the way? We're going to see Mangle. We should probably let her know we're on our way so the same thing that happened with Foxy doesn't happen again. And how would we do that? You got that surveillance system for being the night guard, right? Well, you can talk through the microphones. Really? Yeah, hand it here and I'll show you. Hand the device to Bonnie. Mangle, do you hear me? We're on our way, alright? Come out now so I don't have to come in after you. So much here to see you. Bonnie hands the surveillance system back to you. Alright, it'll only take us another second. Do get there. Alright. Hello? Hello. Hello, this is Mango, as I'm sure you already know. So I'm, sh I'm assuming you're the new night guard then. Welcome to the restaurant. You sound a little depressed. What's wrong? Oh, nothing really. I just don't like being around people. Yeah, I know that feeling. I barely like being around any of the other animatronics. Fair enough. Fair enough. I understand. I used to be the same way. Actually, still am. Something will happen eventually that would convince you that people are okay. Probably not. Probably years and years of repression will probably bottle you up inside. I mean, yeah, yeah, um, no, you'll be okay. You'll be okay. Yeah, you're probably right. All right, we should probably be off. We got to get the night guard back to his room a few hours before the restaurant opens in case the managers are here early. It's been a pleasure. You and Bonnie walk back to your room. Well, I hope that you've learned more about us and you'll come back every day. Yeah, I definitely will. You guys are pretty, all pretty cool. Alright, need to get back to the stage now. I'll talk to you tomorrow night. Alright, Bonnie. Good night. I think that's night one. I hear, I hear the alarm. I know you can't hear it because I muted this. Uh, the songs. That I didn't care for, but yeah. Yeah, night two. And we'll end on that note. Uh, hope you enjoyed this night one. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Join the pack. Till next time, take care.